I had left work and uh, I didn't feel quite right. I went home and I had some pain in my neck and uh, went to bed, laid down for a while and then I, I got up, felt better and got some dinner and went back to bed later that evening. And uh, as soon as I hit the bed, I felt like the house was turned upside down. And then my, I guess, stubbornness to say, oh, I'll be fine, you know, I'm just tired. And then uh, I started rolling uncontrollably to one side and then I, I couldn't swallow. Then I realized I had a problem. I couldn't eat. Um, I wanted to learn how to walk again, which I did. Um, I think I had a lot of mixed emotions when I first came here, a lot of hopefulness, a lot of despair, a lot of expectations. And, uh, but um, I knew when I left here I could do what I wanted to do, get back to, I could start to work back toward what I wanted to do, get back to normal, and um, I did. The impact, this has, is just like a family here. I mean, um, as a patient, I, I felt it, and as a coworker, I feel we're all a team, we're all a family. Uh, we go through goods and bad days together, um, and it's uh, very rewarding because we're actually here for the patient's care. And uh, each patient is individualized. It's not, they just don't, they're not given a number, and then just, you know, but each person, their care is specific to their needs. And um, it's rewarding, and I like to give back to what they did for me. I think the doctors and nurses and staff here are excellent, the therapists. Um, they honestly do care, and it shows in their productivity and what they do for each individual patient. Uh, it's easy for people to say, you know, we'll, we'll help you, we'll do stuff, but actually when you see them tearing up when you do something good, you know they feel it. You know it's compassion, you know it's sincere. And um, they're all that way, it's a team, like I said before, it's a team effort and everybody is on the same team. It's important for them to get back to physical activity and uh, occupational therapy and speech and all, and get, to get all the therapy they need to get back to normal. Um, they need to start it right away and if they ever want to get back into their old life again. And uh, it's very important and I would encourage them strongly to do so. I often counsel with the families and uh, with the patients and uh, encourage them along the way through therapies. It's very difficult. I mean, it's, it's, it's very difficult but they can see hope at the end of the tunnel. I try to show them the, the hope at the end of the tunnel, the, the light at the end of the tunnel, and so it gives them something to work toward. Their therapy sessions are based on what they really want. In fact, when they come in, uh, one of their questions that they have a therapy session on the evaluation period is what you like to do, and that's what we strive to get them back toward. And it also gives them a sense of progress is when they can start doing things. Some people like to go golfing, some like to go fishing, whatever it may be, but we try to incorporate that in their therapy sessions and give them hope. I'm blessed to be here. Um, God has given me another chance and um, I really feel that that's the only reason I'm here, uh, that God protect. He gave me another chance. He really did. And uh, he's got another purpose for me and so this might be it. I believe this is it.